Okay, here we go. All right. Ducks uh, have two games into the books and one win. 14 games earlier than last year. Congratulations, guys. Great effort in Minnesota, uh, especially the way you bounce back from uh, an opening game loss. Going left to right, Jack Kupstein uh, in the middle is Coach Truock, and on the right is uh, Keenan Miller from uh, Wisconsin Rapids. So first of all, congratulations, like I said. Uh, Jack, uh, you, had a, you, had, you were heavily involved uh, in the game two win. Uh, what were the biggest changes you made you know, after Friday and then into Saturday? Uh, I think some of the biggest changes were playing as a team. Uh -huh. The first game we were kind of individuals. Okay. And then the second game we really came together as a team and pulled out the big one. Okay. Um, Coach Sherlock, we talked a little bit in there about uh, um, just different things. The discipline was obviously a lot better in the second game. Uh, you thought maybe that, that you were kind of getting sucked into stuff in the first game, but just better that way too, right? Yeah, um, it seemed like uh, more on Friday we were kind of, as you said, sucked into their nonsense. And right. on uh, Saturday it was kind of them like kind of doing that BS behind the, you know, like, how do I say that? Like they, they almost took the uh, bad penalties compared to us taking them. And they were dejected after we went up 3-0. And uh, it would be better if we could have, you know, closed out on a higher note and kind of get our heels in the third period. But um, the way we responded on in the third, on Saturday night is, is what is key to me there because that was tough to take on Friday and the way the guys right. came together as Jack said as a team. It was really good to see. And Keenan, um, as a younger player, um, the first game must have been kind of discouraging, but clearly... The veterans and the coaches must have had a message afterwards because it looked like you took the ice on Saturday with full confidence, the whole team, knowing that you, you had a really good shot to win. So what was really, was there a lot of talking in between games? Yeah, I feel like we kind of got our first game jitters out of the way. Okay. Um, definitely a lot higher pace than what kids are normally used to playing. Um, so I think we just came onto the ice knowing we could play with them and we could compete at that high level. And uh, we just went hard. Okay. Um, now the goaltending is part of the defense, so uh, that's you know that's all part of it. But uh, clearly, I mean, there's there's work to be done still. It's early in the season. Uh, Jack, uh, you gave up a lot of shots, uh, even in the second game. So I guess that continues to be something that you guys need to address. I guess. Yeah, I mean, it happens first and second game. You, yeah. Uh, you got to work together, work harder, and uh, block those shots. But we'll get better as we go. Okay, and coach, I guess, you know, the, the, the positive thing is, yeah, he saw a lot of rubber, but, um, you know, usually if he's, only, if he's only got a couple getting by him, uh, the guys are letting him see the shots and they're keeping him from a distance. So it might be a little bit misleading, but uh, like we said, there's still work to be done, right? Yeah, um, yeah I think cleaner through, cleaner out of our zone and cleaner through the neutral zone. And as Keenan said, the jitters are out now, so the boys should be moving the puck a little bit better this weekend and through those zones a lot cleaner. So that should keep a lot of the shots off. Right. But yeah, you're right. The key is, is that he saw most of the shots. Right. So that was easier for him um, and better work on these two guys' end and the rest of the decor to be able to have him see those shots and be able to make those saves for us. Okay. How did it feel in the last couple of minutes, Austin? Uh, they really they threw everything they had at you. I mean, you, you had to feel good seeing uh, Austin shot go in. That was kind of the clincher, but uh, they did kind of have us on our heels there for a, for a bit at the end of the game, didn't they? Yeah, I mean, that was huge that he was able to put it in the net. Like, that's not an easy shot all the way down yeah. the ice. And, uh, I mean, if it misses the net, they get a face off in our zone. So kind of a high risk, high reward uh, shot. Uh, absolutely. But I'm glad it worked out when the net and uh, we were able to go up there. Okay. Um, what do you remember about the mullets, Jack? Um, we kind of had their number a bit last year. Obviously, things change year to year, but is there kind of an identity that that team has, or, or is there a way that they play that, that we need to prepare for? Uh, every team is the same, in my opinion. Go in, expect them to work hard. Can't take uh, take team for granted, for sure. So we got to head up. we got to go into that game thinking that we are going to win, but we have to okay. play our butts off. 
All right, that's that's nice, coach. You got to like that. Instead of trying to address the other team's game, you're just going to play your own game. Yeah, I think that's uh, we uh, we kind of have come together as a group and figured out that the more we worry about ourselves being good right. and playing that consistent game that we played on Saturday, clean up the third period, but more worry about ourselves there when it comes to playing that clean 60 minutes uh, is more important than worrying about you know what they're going to bring to us. As long as we bring to the table what we need to bring to the table, then we'll be good all year. Okay. Have you been to Augsburg before? Uh, I've not. No. Um, what's it like, Jack? I mean, I, I'm, I'm thinking it's probably a little bit bigger rink than uh, than the ones we normally play in, but it's kind of empty too, right? Oh uh, yeah, it's uh, good ice and they they pack sometimes, and uh, it's really fun to play there. Awesome. Well, good luck on the weekend, guys. Hopefully, we can get another couple dubs before we open at home.